Okay guys, here we are. So we've, uh, in video two, we've put together the printer. Now, I've had a little go already, and uh, I've got to say, they've uh, made it fairly simple. So plug your main cable in. On the back of the printer, you have a voltage switch. So if you're in the US or you're in a country that's uh, 110 volt, 130 volts, there's a little red switch you have to click across. I'm on 230. Put it on the one that you, corresponds to where you live. So, I've had a go. I've printed out a Benji, all right? Get your USB stick. Okay, let's turn it on. It's gonna fire up. Okay, and the first time you do this, you'll go through a small setup menu. It doesn't take long. Set your time zone, your Wi-Fi code, and um, not, not really much more, I don't think. Uh, but I had to do a test before because I don't want anything going up going on in the video, you know So anyway along the bottom now once you've done your setup you'll have your home screen This is showing me now after the first print uh, Temperatures then you've got your second screen, which is where you can adjust some things some axes movements and uh, I haven't really touched any of this you don't need to worry straight away here in the little file looking thing This is the boat that's already printed. Settings, you can go through here. You've got system, oh, camera. So you can set up a camera, I guess. I haven't gone into all of this, the network, and then system, you've got all sorts of different stuff. What it says in the manual is just to plug in the key, all right? So we'll plug that in. USB flash drive inserted. Let's go to file, okay? And it will give you the, the boat, all right? tap on your boat just press print and it starts to go through the motions it actually takes a minute to start sort of going in the slice I guess they've they've already calibrated it to go through a, a bed leveling and a obviously a preheat it's very nice the way it all kind of just happens I feel I've been using the ANET A8 and uh, it's it's manual uh, bed leveling and so this thing just makes the world a difference and then it's set now to heat up to 180 and 60 on the nozzle 180 on the bed 60 on the nozzle I, I do believe that they've set this to kind of go flat out you'll see when it starts to print that it is actually going like the clappers this is my first Benji okay and uh, it done all right <laughs> it was just going so fast everything was wobbling the tables wobbling the, it was all over the place but it came out fairly well full speed flat out 16 minute and you got that anyway i, I had to try it first guys because you know anything can happen on a video and you just don't, and then you're wasting video so touch your screen if it goes off and it will come back up it's still going through its pre-checks. It does quite a, f a few things. So now it's doing the level and there's about 20 points or so of leveling. So it's quite, it's quite fast. The build plate, leave it to cool and the part just literally just comes off, no problem. So this is the setup process, guys. I mean, it does go on a little bit, I feel. Now it's saying to preheat the bed to 220 degrees. And one day I might make an enclosure for it because I really want to try and print some different stuff, some different filaments, ABS of style. Now it's doing its swipe. It's actually left a nice little, there we go. Now we're off guys, holy moly. It is a speedy little printer, I've got to say. Okay guys, so we've cooled down. So 
about 10 minutes maybe and not even leave it to about 60 degrees i'll turn the machine off so we haven't got all the fan noise the fans do cut off on their own but then there's another noise of it just working and benji our little benji it's still warm but <laughs> let's have a look close up now okay we've got the writing there that came out pretty nice the base now i've got the same kind of dropped line there if you see under under the uh, canopy you know it's fairly clean i'm not sure what, what what kind of quality they sliced it at you know if they did a draft maybe quality but there's my second benji which would be your first benji and uh, the detail on the top kind of came out fairly well this time as well it's like some planking or something no string in the you know the top bit came out nice the uh, and we're going at probably 100 percent speed you know so if you slow the whole thing down in the slicer to kind of 60 percent or 70 or whatever you want i'm sure we'll get a cleaner print and play with some other settings you know to get the lines a little bit smoother and everything's wobbling because it's going so fast but that's your first kind of print off guys the first benji and to be fair it's very plug and play this printer it's simple now i've got this i'm going to crack on and i'm going to design some stuff and i'm going to be printing away happily the first benji came out pretty well thanks for watching click on the buttons help us out with the channel the new channel so um Help us out by clicking the like at least before you go. And I'll see you guys in the future, hopefully, on the videos coming up. So stay tuned and uh, I'll be back with more. See you later, guys. Bye.